Here's how I spend my 160,000 executive assistant salary as a 33 year old. My gross income for August was $12,400. However, 4,360 of that went to taxes, making my take home pay $8,050. I also have additional income sources, including like to social media, TikTok revenue, which brought in an additional $8,000, bringing my total take home pay for August to $16,050, which I recognize is a ton of money, guys, and I'm very blessed. Let's get into the expenses. I spent $3,000 on rent and utilities. And yes, my rent is too damn high, but I live in DC. And since I work from home, I have a dedicated office space as well. I put a majority of my day-to-day -day expenses on my Amex Platinum credit card for the point and the breakdown looks like $180 a month for my gym membership. I go to Lifetime. I spent about $670 on restaurants and DoorDash because I love to eat out, but I'm trying to curb that. I spent about $200 on groceries. I'm trying to curb, I'm trying to cook more. Um, I have a cleaner that comes to my apartment three times a week, $300 to get my sister's locks retied, um, another $300 about every six weeks. Um, I traveled a lot in August to visit my family in New Jersey, New York, so I spent about $880 on Ubers and trains. I have a therapist. I spent $600 for two meetings twice a month with her. My phone bill is $60. I'm going to Columbia next month, so I booked the flight. That was $400. Got to start shopping for Columbia, $560. My subscriptions are about $75 dollars a month student loan payments have restarted so i put five thousand dollars to my student loans i have about five thousand dollars left i started with one hundred and sixty thousand. so in total for august i spent twelve thousand two hundred and twenty five dollars still due to my additional income i have about four thousand dollars left over for the month and i put two thousand in my high yield savings account and another two thousand in my investment account um, I pay off my credit cards every month and I have about $5,000 of debt, my student loans left. Um, if you want to see how I became a six-figure executive assistant, give me a follow. And if you have any questions on any of the things I mentioned, leave a comment below.